Art of Hitting channel. Today we got, we're going to do a piece on keeping the old man out. We're going to feature a, a, a player, coach, uh, interesting 88-year-old uh, man uh, that has the spirit of a, a, a young man, uh, Rocco. I hope you enjoy this piece on Rocco. He's an interesting guy and a guy you could emulate. Well, they, they hit good, but they do what I really enjoy, which makes you win the game. They play the fabulous defense. They give us seven runs, no matter who you play. We're 80 years old. There's still a lot of runs for 80 year olds to get. But all my men just dig in and play a little harder, play a little better. And I want to, this is a lead into a clip I'm doing on a, on a guy I met up close and personal uh, this weekend. Uh, his name is Rocco. He happens to be the sponsor and um, the coach of Florida Investment Properties. Uh, uh, the team has done quite well, well over the years. So well, their team has to give seven, seven runs away um, uh, per game to some teams. And the reason I want to do this feature on Rocco, he's an interesting guy. He's 88 years old. I think he's going on 89. Uh, he, he's full of life. Uh, you can see it in his face. He, he, he's a funny dude coaching, and, I, and you'll see some of that in there. But he's entertaining and uh, interesting guy. He loves softball and uh, just as honest can, as can be. Uh, straightforward guy. Um, just loves life. you got to enjoy a guy like that. Uh, someone that you, you'd probably want to emulate. You know, he's always smiling, always happy. Good smile on his, on his face. Uh, enjoy meeting Rocco. Nice job, real nice job. I don't know if I got the swing, but I got you running. So, where are we at? This, so, okay, what, what we got here? Rocky, special. Yeah, dude. You, Rocky, you, I'm going to make do a feature on you. The Rock, what's your last name, Rocky? Camberary. Camberary. The one and only. You've ever been in the mob or what? Oh, yeah. Oh, I knew all of them. Did you? you know they wanted me to join them years ago, and I had no money. I said, no, I make more money than you guys make. What were you doing up in New York? Robbing banks? Hell's Kitchen. No, no, I was a... We had a... Uh, my father had a luncheonette right after the war started. The first war, second war. And then I was six years old. He taught me how to wash dishes, make hamburgers, sell cigarettes. And then I learned how to throw good because I put the bread boxes against the glass wall there. He said, you break the glass wall, I'll kill you. And boom, they slide into a basket. And I put... I mixed them up. Mission Orange. And Coca-Cola, Pepsi, you want uh, <laughs> Great day. Never got a cigarette wet because my hands were always wet, so I pushed the pack up, let the people take their own cigarettes. Pennies! But those days, you know, they were good living days. We used to go under the pump with the water. Yeah, back in the day, man. So how long you been in the softball? Yeah. Let's move this over here. Let's move this over. This is Kelly. Kelly. So you look like you're going younger, man. You should go, I mean, you, you can't be over 25, huh? She heard all about Mr. Rose, how wonderful he is. How what? How good he can hit that ball. I watched him. And his legs were moving a little short today. You know what's funny? You don't have to run hard when you hit that You know what's funny? Right in, you know what's funny? Right in the seventies, when I get at the bat, them guys are back on the fence. I thought I had to I run get, out to third base and catch it before you. Dude, if it wasn't, I had uh, twenty percent less lung. I'd have had an inside bark on run. I heard that you're doing okay. I mean, you're doing great. Well, I'm better than I should be, you but I'm tired. You made it to third. I'm tired. Are you going to send this thing to Hollywood so everybody can well, see it? Well, Hollywood can look at it. I got over 400 videos out there. <laughs> yeah. They might get lost. So who is this young lady now? I am Kelly Griss. Jerry Johnson. Jerry Johnson. He's a, he's a stud, that Jerry Johnson I heard. He's, big, he's a legend in his own mind. Well, we Jerry all are. Jerry Johnson wins all the FIP trophies. We all, we all are legends in our own mind. Jerry Johnson has a record double shutout two years ago. He, he, he told me if we had bat him clean up, we'd have won he by four more runs. He shut out the Texas team, and he did a very good job. Why? Just Why? give you a little insight on Rocco uh, uh, coaching at third. Uh, he does a heck of a job. He's uh, into the game. He gets a little excited when his players don't Roy, listen to him. But Roy, just give you a little inside look at this great guy.
Watch the line drives. Stand up, stand up. Stand up, stand up. Ah. Rocco doing his thing. Look at him move. <laughs> nice hit, Kaz. I have to apologize a little bit for the coughing, but I can't help it because I just had lung surgery 25 days ago. And it just looks, I, I got this for a while, I guess. Apologize. Blowing. Louis. No, no, Kai. Yeah, okay, Kai's is going to get it. Easy, easy. Oh, oh. Easy. God damn it. Jesus Christ. What did he fall? Fucking hamster. Oh, no. Fucking hamster. Yeah, yeah. Jesus Christ almighty. Oh, damn it. That's, God God. Damn it. That's the one guy we don't No, we don't want to say Rocco, my man, you got uh, half lost half your team. You put a team together. You come out here. They they tell you you got to give seven runs away, and you go undefeated. What do you well, say about that, buddy? The boys, first of all, they, they hit good. But they do what I really enjoy, which makes you win the game. They play the fabulous defense. And giving seven runs, no matter who you're playing, we're 80 years old. There's still a lot of runs for 80 year olds to get. But all my men just dig in and play a little harder, play a little better. And you can't ask anything more than what they do at. They, they, including yourself. I mean, each and every one is an individual, and you have to treat them as individuals. And I do that. That's my forte that I can help each one. I, I never can uh, put one player's name on because I have hundreds play with me, and if I miss one, it's boo boo on me. So. I just enjoy every player that played through, including you. You, did, <laughs> well, that's you good. did a great job for me, Eddie. You don't even know how much you helped this team. You gave them spirit. They watch you play. They watch you hit that ball. There's things in this game that people don't understand. Being an ex-professional, I have a little more t knowledge about what has to be done and how it has to be done and when it has to be done. So that only helps me for my team. As far as playing, my playing days are over at 88 and a half years old. I enjoy just doing what I'm doing. But you and know, I'm going to continue doing it to the guy upstairs who needs a manager up there. <laughs> and I, that's where I'll be going, I guess. I well, hope. I, I got to talk for a minute because it's the first time, I, you know, I've I, I seen you from afar, interviewed you a couple of times. Right. But I can see why you live long because you want a happy individual. You're always smiling. Now, you cuss a lot, which I but you haven't. You, 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 you mean well, you're, you, you know, and, and you got everybody's well, my, best interest. My heart. mother paid me a, a great compliment when I was a young kid, 12, 13 years old. And my father was fantastic, too, because I, I, I was a copy, copy, copy almost a half. And she said, Rocco, you just go along, don't worry about life. You know exactly what to do all the time, she says. So I said, well, thank you, Mom. I, I said, I try, but she says, you don't have to try. It's a natural thing that comes to people. She says, but that's what I do, Eddie. I, I, I have not one enemy in senior softball. I don't steal any players. Before a player comes to my roster, I speak to their ex-manager. If he's old enough, then I don't have to, but I still talk to the manager about him just to have a little safeness with myself. Well, you look Thank great, you. man. For your age, you look great. You look like you're going to live yeah. to 110. So, hey, it's been my pleasure, buddy. Thank you, Eddie. Yeah, take care. I'll talk to you in four. I'll see you in the yeah. next TLC. Yes, sir. Don't forget to hit subscribe. It's free. See you in the next one.